Happy New Year. This means that it is actually time to wrap up last year's along. To say the very least, 2020 was a year. Um, as I said, that's all I'm going to say about it. You know you were there. Let's move on to the positives. We're going to start off this recap by celebrating those who entered FOs in the great podcast or craft together in 2020. So join in with me and help celebrate Cindy L, craft worker, D door four, Elsa and M, Emily R, I now our, Joda Daya, Chaos one two seven, Knit Central, Knitter Chow, Linda or L McCall, Meditative Crafter, Mo's Crochet, Nicole S, Original Sin, The Zeneca, Chai Linda, V Shaw seven, V T Kim Kim, and Walsh Central. So congratulations, everyone! Thank you so much all year long for your participation in the long you have no idea how much i appreciate you uh it would just be me talking to myself and playing this game by myself if you guys didn't help participate and you didn't i'm glad everyone had so much fun let's put it that way <laughs> okay what you're really here for right the prize winners not my rambling i know you're here for the prize winners for the ten dollar gift card or pattern winners for january it was post number 61 who is vt kimmy kim in february it was post number 247 who is l mccall in march it was post number 160 who is i now our in april it was post number 78 who is vt kimmy kim in may it was post number 131 who is nicole s for june it was post number 145 who is Walsh Central. For July, it was actually post number 316, who is Walsh Central. For August, it was post number 80, who is Meditative Crafter. For September, it was post number 378, who is I Now Hour. For October, it was post number 261, who is Walsh Central. For November, it was actually post number 602, who is I Now Hour. And for December, it was post number 301, who is Moshe Crochet. So congratulations everyone who participated. If you have actually won a prize for any of those who haven't contacted me already, what's going to happen is you actually would have to send me a message via either DM on either Discord, on Facebook, via the group, or you can actually send me an email at silversdreamland at gmail.com. I will go ahead and I will send you over a wool warehouse gift card of $10 for each one of those winners. All right, for the Java Pearl Designs winners, we do have in January, it was post number 28, who is Craft Worker. For February, it was post number 273, who is Walsh Central. For March, it was post number 113, who is Meditative Crafter. For April, it was post number 89, who is Walsh Central. For May, it was post number 278, who was Jodadiah. In June, it was post number 258, who is Original Sin. For July, it was post number 325, who is D Door 4. Also, D Door 4 won in August for her post number 354. In September, it was post number 40, who is also D Door 4. In October, the winner was post number two, 210, who is Trilinda. They're on Rav. For November, it was post number 236, who is D Door 4 on Ravelry. And for December, it was post number seven, sorry, 795, who is a VT Kimmy Kim. Congratulations, everyone who won a prize. If all those winners could actually send me a message, again, via either DM or even via email at silverstreamman at gmail.com with which pattern you would like from Java Pearl Designs, I'll go ahead and I will message Stacey for you to get those prizes and she will send them over as soon as she can. She's going to be sending that via D, uh, via direct pdf so you know the winners of my patterns as for quarter one it was post number 175 who is walsh central for quarter two it was post number 254 who is a meditative crafter for quarter three it was actually post number 47 who is i know our for quarter four 
it is post number 257 who is nicole s so congratulations you four you can actually send me a direct message via either discord on facebook or you can even send it via silverstreaming at gmail.com with which pattern in my repertoire you would like and i will send you a direct pdf so congratulations in terms of the most loves in january the winner was post number 96 who is nicole s in February, it was actually post number 159, who was again Nicole S. For March, it was post number 229, who again was Nicole S. For April, there was actually a tie between two, post number 293, I'm sorry, 292, who is Nicole S. And post number 294, who is Original Sin. For May, there was another tie between post number 356, who is Nicole S. And post number 363, who is I Now Our. For June, the winner was post number 389, who is Elle McCall. For July, it was actually post number 441, who is Nicole S. In August, it was actually post number 558, who is VT Kimmy Kim. For September, there was another tie between VT Kimmy Kim for post number 607 and Nicole S for post number 633. In October, the winner was VT Kimmy Kim. In November, there was again another tie between Emily R for post number 682 and post number 683, who is Linda. In December, again, another tie between Emily and Linda for Emily's post number 725 and Linda's post number 765. So congratulations, everyone, if you can actually direct message me either on Discord or you can even send a message via Facebook and or to the email address at silversdreaming at gmail.com with which wool warehouse you'd like your $10 gift card through and I will go ahead and send it to you as fast as I possibly can. <laughs> All right, the voters who won prizes throughout the year for January, it was post number three, who is V. Shaw 7. For February, it was post number nine, who is L. McQuall. For March, it was post number five, who is Joda Daya. In April, the winner was I Now Hour. In May, the winner was Walsh Central. In June, the winner was L. McQuall. In July, the winner was Elsa and M. In August, the winner was I Now Hour. In September, it was Cindy on Facebook. In October, it was Nicole S. In November, it was Nicole S again. And in December, it was Meditative Crafter. Again, if you can PM me with which warehouse you would like to get a gift card through, I will go ahead and send that over. If you have not already contacted me. All right, in terms of other prize winners, this was definitely before we moved off of Ravelry. So we had a 50 post winner up until 400 post winner when we reached those different milestones. For reaching 50 posts, the winner of this was post number 52, who is Nicole S. For reaching 100 posts, it was V Shaw 7. For reaching 150 posts, it was uh, post number 110, who is D Door 4. For getting up to 200 posts, the winner was post number 25, who is VT Kimmy Kim. For post number 250, the post number 176, that was D-Door 4. For getting up to 300 posts, that was up post 73, who is a Meditative Crafter. For post, for reaching 350 posts, the winner, that was post number 12, that was Wall Central. For us reaching up to 400 posts, the winner was post number 150, who is Joda Daya. I happen to know personally that I think everybody has contacted me for those particular prizes on Ravelry. Um, as we have now moved off of Ravelry, uh, I'm sorry, <laughs> we stopped that after 400, even though we did get way over 800 posts. Anyway, neither here nor there. All right, you guys do want to know who won all those wonderful physical prizes, right? Because I can't wait to share this with you guys. I did this all random number a couple days ago. All right. You all want to know. For this, for all the physical prizes, if you have won a prize, I do need you to either PM me directly on Discord or even via Facebook or even via email at silverstreamland at gmail.com. I do need to know your, your name. Also, I need to know an address that I can send these prizes to. 
with that in mind, let's talk about winners, right? <laughs> okay, the first winner, the winner of the Desert Vista Dye Works Neon Cotton Candy Colorway is post number 37, who is Nicole S. The winner of the Desert Vista Dye Works Zombody Needs Some Courage Colorway was post number 439, who is Elsa and M. Oh, we're on Ravelry. Now, the winner of the Desert Vista Dye Works, the mother of all Zombody Queens colorway, goes to post number 434, who is Mose Crochet. The winner of the Nice and Knit Stand Dollar colorway goes to post number 569, who is a Meditative Crafter. The winner of the Nice and Knit Times Square colorway goes to post number 339, who is Walsh Central. The winner of the Sweet Georgia Yarns Rainbow Sprinkles colorway goes to post number 813, who is I Now Hour. And the winner of the Knit Picks Gold Needle Organizer does go to post number 50, who is a Meditative Crafter. So congratulations, you seven. Thank you so much for participating in the along. And congratulations again for winning these wonderful yarn and prizes. Oh. Oh, I can't wait for you guys to see them in person. They were absolutely gorgeous. So like I said, I'm just going to reiterate, make sure you send me either a PM on Discord or on Facebook. Or you can even send me an email at silversdreamyarn at gmail.com. And I will send those out as soon as I possibly can. All right. With that, we're going to have an epic show off of everyone's FO throughout the course of the year. Now, just looking at the timeline before I put any kind of audio in, it's over two hours. <laughs> so if you do not want to go ahead and watch them all, I do understand. If you do need to take it in multiple chunks, I understand as well. If you do decide not to watch through, I do understand. Like I said, I will see you with the next along. Happy crafting, y'all.
If you made it through the entire video, I really do appreciate you. Thank you for joining the great podcaster craft together again in 2020. I had a lot of fun this past year. I really hope you did too. Until next so long, happy crafting.